with some sinking and floating. We need a bowl filled with water and then you need some items that you've gathered in your garden and through your house. I went looking with Travis today and I found a rock, I found a piece of Lego, I found a paper clip and a hair clip and a leaf and a key and a peg and a cork and an apple. What we're going to do is we're going to put them in the water and see if they sink, if they go down to the bottom, or if they float, if they stay on top of the water or in, at the top of the water. Let's make some labels here. Let's write, we're going to see if something sinks. So if it sinks, it's going to go to the bottom of the bowl. And if it floats, it's going to stay near the top of the water. If something sinks, we're going to put it here. If something floats, we're going to put it here. Let's see. Look at our rock. Wow! That sunk. A rock sinks. Let's put it here. What about this Lego? Do you think the Lego will sink or float? Let's see. Ooh, the Lego floats. Let's put it here. What about the paper clip? Do you think the paper clip will sink or do you think it will float? Oh, it sank right to the bottom. Put it in our sinks column. Let's look at our leaf. What do you think our leaf will do? Oh, that's right, our leaf floats. Let's look at our key. The key sunk, it went to the bottom, it sinks. Let's look at our hair clip. Oh, that also went to the bottom, that was also a sinker. Let's look at this wooden peg. Hmm, that's interesting. The peg floats. What about the cork? What do you think the cork will do? Oh, the cork also floats. Now here, I have an apple. Do you think an apple will sink or do you think it will float? It floats! Look at that! The apple floats. Let's see what we've got here. The stone, the paper clip, the key and the hair clip all were things that sink. The Lego, the leaf, the pig, the cork and even the apple were things that float. Sink and float. This is an easy experiment you can set up at home and send me photos of what you've been doing. Abby and Darwin would love to see things that sink and things that float.